Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the Morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. My Country 96.1, Fathead Candy Roth. We're looking at a decent start to the day, 45, mix of sun and clouds. We uh, get some rain later tonight. You might be in your house about that time, but the rain begins, goes overnight, ends about 7, 8 o'clock in the morning, and um, yeah, you know, we'll be fine. The rest of the weekend looks okay, a little windy, whatever, but... Uh, now, when does rain start today? Yeah, later, like 9, later. 10 o'clock tonight. Yeah. Oh, okay, good, because I have to do a few things this morning. Oh, we well, <laughs> You'll be just and fine. And I don't want to melt in the rain. Mm, my sweet, delicate candy. Just yes, you'll be fine. Yes, the Wicked Witch. Mm, everything will be okay. Uh, and Yeah, the weekend looks dry, but Sunday could be windy. Got a lot of football this weekend, candy. Exciting I don't like times. what they've already done, putting one thing on whatever it is. What is that channel? Peacock, they on? peacock. That really makes me angry. Yeah, nah, I'm, I'm upset. I can't. That's going to be a great game, too. Can't, yeah. uh, can't well, watch it. Well, we won't it. know. Yeah, that's exactly right. Um, uh, yes, I have a 16-year-old today in this household. You do. Hold on to the car keys. Oh, Leah, 16 years old. Amazing. Uh, yeah, so happy birthday to my sweet girl. She's a good girl. She's a man. She just uh, She's a joy to have around, Candy. She really is, so. Uh, can't say it enough. Um, All right. Well, you do say it plenty. So. Hey! <laughs> How's that granddaughter of yours, huh? She's mm -hmm. perfect. <laughs> yeah. That's what I thought. Oh, behave. Uh, I won't send you any pictures. Oh, uh, nope. I will keep my mouth shut. Uh, right. Before we get to national days, it is Quitters Day today. What do you mean? If you have a New Year's resolution, today is the day to quit. Well, today's the day that most people I quit. See. Yes, they put it too is, much expectation on themselves. That's the problem. You gotta have yes. baby steps. You have exactly and it's the second Friday in January that is officially Quitters Day after a study in twenty nineteen found statistically it's the day people are most likely to pack it in, give up on the uh, resolution. 80% of resolutions will be done by Ooh. today. That's mm -hmm. why I don't make any. Mm -mm. Yeah. So you got to go slow. Be me go slow. Uh, Be more realistic Day about by your day. Day by day. You know? Yes. That's it. You wake up and say, today I'm going to get all my steps in or whatever it is you want to do. And, and that's it. You, you just work on today. See what tomorrow brings. Tomorrow, if you don't feel like it, you don't feel like it. That is a great way to say what I was going to say about, uh, first thing is you have to celebrate the small accomplishments, Candy. Correct. Absolutely. Right? One and million percent. The other thing, remember, progress always isn't, it's not always, you know, up, 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 up in, in like a nice perfect line. No, it is not. Sometimes you go down. Just like the government. That's <laughs> just like the, it doesn't move at all. The stock market. Yeah, whatever. Yes. Uh, so you have to be realistic about yes. these things. Yeah, and not hard on yourself. Be good to yourself. Yes. Man, are we inspirational or Man, I can't take me. I'm going to give myself a big kiss here in five <laughs> minutes. <laughs> You're such a good person. <laughs> so good. All right. Uh, Nas yeah, yeah. National days today, Candy. It is National Marzipan Day. I'm one, I think, of a few people who like that. I do like it. I'm trying to think if I've ever had marzipan. Um, you know, the colored, it's got different colors. It's got mm. like chalk, maybe chocolate on the top, and it's like green and yellow and whatever, and it hmm. that's marzipan. It's like I know almond based oh, something. Okay. Yeah. I was getting confused with halva, right? That's sesame, and that's different, yes. Okay, all right. Uh, it is National Curried Chicken Day. Have you ever? I'm not a huge fan of curry. All right. I don't know that I've ever had curry, honestly. Like, I, I don't, right, isn't that, that's Indian food usually with the curry? Yes, yes. I don't know, yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, when I go well, to Indian restaurants, that's not what I get, so. All right. It's National Pharmacist Day today. We love our pharmacists when they're kind and good and they pay attention to you. 
Yes, love, uh, thank you for making sure my medications are all correct. We appreciate you. Back in you. the day, we mm -hmm. had a pharmacist, his name was Stanley, when I was a kid. And my parents, you know, if I had something, let's say my eye was red or whatever, mm -hmm. we'd go to the pharmacist, not the doctor. <laughs> yeah, yeah, well, it, you know. We'd go in, and my father would say, Stanley. What's going on with her? And he'd look, come around and look and say, oh, I see. Okay, I know what she needs. And then he was a wonderful human being. It's funny you say that. We had a very close family friend. His name was Bob, and Bob was the local pharmacist. And we'd go in, and, uh, you know, he's a good friend of the family. And I remember he used to, like, take an empty pill bottle with nothing in it and like do tricks like throw it behind his back and like he'd oh, give me an empty pill bottle. Oh, a little show on the side. I love yeah. that. Yeah. No, it was... Uh, it not was... it. I yeah. haven't come across one as friendly in a long time where you uh. can actually get their help. You know what I mean? But well, I, the I don't. see, I don't... Unless you go to a small... A mom and pop store, which we don't anymore. I guess the ones who work for the big, the big chains, you know, they're they're getting down yeah. to business. You know, there's, yeah. Yeah. you know, not not that personalization. But Stanley, my pharmacist, I think of him fondly. No, every now that's and nice. then, for sure. And it is uh, National Kiss a Ginger Day today. Oh, uh, look out, Ellen, with your red hair. You're gonna get it today. That's what she. <laughs> She'll love she, it. Hope she gets she, it today. She is a redhead, boy. I'll yes, tell you that. Yes, she is. Whoa. No doubt. Uh, so if there's a ginger in your life, uh, yeah. Uh, Candy, some good news. Then we'll uh, we'll uh, set the scene for our weekends here. Um, your next paycheck could be a tad bigger than usual. Even if you didn't get a raise, the IRS adjusted tax brackets for 2024 based on inflation. So if you're making the same as last year or only got a cost of living bump, you might have a little less money withheld for taxes. Well, that is good news. Yeah. Just a little, uh, it doesn't say how much. Every little a, bit is good. Yeah. A couple bucks. Who knows? Yeah. Uh, a couple flying back to New Jersey after a vacation in Mexico had their five-month-old daughter with them. And by the time they landed, a woman next to them had crocheted a hat for the child wow, to, ce to celebrate her first flight. It was the five-year-old's first flight. They landed, and the woman was crocheting, and she handed the family a beautiful hat for the... Is that... I, what a thing. That's unbelievable. What, that is you one of the... so many nasty <laughs> people on a plane. Don't kick my seat. Don't play music. Don't do anything. The kids, you know, I feel for the parents with little kids because, you know, some people are so nasty about it. And to see this, oh, that's a great story. That is one of the most beautiful things I've ever heard. It's a really. great story. Great story. And a 31-year-old guy in Michigan, uh, Cody Ennis, is in the news after he didn't cut his hair for four years so he could make a wig for his girlfriend Hannah who has alopecia and oh. he joked that if he grew his hair out for her there's no way she could break up with him oh well if nice. she's wearing his hair on her head yeah that would be difficult and if they did break up does she get rid of the wig that's the question <laughs> I don't want to think about that yeah but that's a nice gesture very very mm -hmm. lovely uh, Candy, set the scene for your weekend. You got your big Christmas Eve party now. Going. Again, take two. Mm. Um, yeah, so today I have to do a few errands and getting the house in order and getting everything we need. And um, I'll let you know how it works out. The party starts at three. I'll send pictures and uh, let's hope everybody comes healthy, leaves healthy, and we have a good time. Is there, speaking of which, is there a leave? time is there no. something no doesn't no. no 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 um and i don't want those kids of mine like well i'm talking about jackie and casey to start telling me well you know her because they'll go to her mother's for days on end so don't tell me about her schedule or she, when her you know no you're gonna sit here and have a good time till i say so so if it's oh man this is gonna be fun on <laughs> monday fun it's gonna be fun so they show up at three she gets yeah. a, little, a little, like eight, like seven thirty, eight o'clock. Yeah, She's a little cranky, exactly. and, yeah. and, and and they're gonna get up to to leave, and you you're yeah. gonna throw a fit. Is that no, a, I'm not gonna throw a fit. Okay. I talk a big game, but no, All I'm right. not, because I I've had children and I know how it is. How's that? Hmm. I'm curious. I'm sure you're gonna have a great time. It's gonna be oh, awesome. So. No doubt. No doubt. Yeah. Me uh, is a good time all on her own. 
and and Brian uh, is okay with people staying as late as they want, or do you just want to kick people out? How does that work? No, 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 no. Okay. He's good. He, he's like a background guy. You know what I mean? He watches and listens till you know make a comment here or there or whatever and you know he's very good with the food and whatever and yeah, all right he watches and then he'll tell me everything he saw that perhaps i didn't see you know okay good we will uh, that's nice he we will uh, reconvene monday by the way my kids excited uh, they're all excited they have a three-day weekend uh, schools are closed for uh, right that's Mar right martin luther king yeah monday yeah. um but we will be on. We will be here. We will recap your uh, Christmas Eve party. Uh, we will recap Leah's birthday uh, today. We'll yes. get into all that. We got a lot of football to talk about from the weekend coming what up. What games here. we're allowed to see? Yeah. Uh, and uh, yeah, we'll have a good time. Now the rain later tonight. We got a good day today. Later tonight, nine ten o'clock. Some rain comes in heavy overnight. Ends by Saturday morning, so you'll be good there. But a lot of those flood spots going to get some more wind and rain. And then the rest of the weekend, not bad. Looks dry. A little windy Sunday, but overall should be good. Let's hit the roads. My country, 96.1. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country, 96.1.